Hello everyone. Today we are going to see the difference between SSD, HDD and hybrid drive. But before we get into the technical detail, it's really important to understand that a computer has two types of memory, primary memory and secondary memory. Primary memory is temporary, such as RAM, while secondary memory is permanent, such as storage drive. As you know, every computer needs a place to store data and information, such as audio files, videos, pictures, documents, and so on. So a computer needs a place to store such data internally on a storage drive, and such drives need to be non-volatile. That means they should keep data, even if you switch off your computer. Now, there are different types of internal storage drives that a computer uses such as magnetic hard drives, solid state drives, and hybrid drives. Let's first talk about magnetic hard drives. They have been around for decades and are the more traditional type of storage device. They were introduced by IBM in 1956. Hard drives consist of a spinning disk coated with a magnetic material and a read-write head that reads and writes data on the disk's surface. The read-write head moves back and forth across the spinning disk to access different parts of data stored on the disk. These spinning disks rotate at very high speed, either at 5400 RPM, 7200 RPM or 10,000 RPM. 5400 RPM hard drive is used in laptops. 7200 RPM hard drive is used in desktop computers. Hard drive that works at 10,000 RPM is not used anymore because of high-speed solid-state drives. Nowadays, hard drives use SATA interface. This new standard is faster than older technology PETA. So instead of data traveling in parallel path, it travels in serial path. SATA delivers 6 gigabits per second transfer speed. Now the most important thing to remember is that Hard drives come in two different sizes, 3.5 inch and 2.5 inch. 3.5 inch is used in desktop computers and 2.5 inch is used in laptops. Now let's talk about the second type of storage device that is called SSD or solid state drive. SSDs use flash memory to store data instead of a spinning disk. Solid state drives have no moving parts making them much faster, more durable and less vulnerable to mechanical failure than hard drives. SSDs offer much quicker data access and transfer speeds than HDDs. SSDs are smaller and lighter than HDDs, making them an ideal option for portable devices such as laptops and tablets. SSDs consume less power than HDDs, making them more energy efficient. SSDs are generally more expensive than HDDs, making them less cost-effective option for storing large amounts of data. Now, SSDs also come in different form factor. They come in 2.5 inch form factor and M.2 form factor. Both of these types store data on flash memory. However, they connect to the motherboard using different interfaces. Standard SSDs use SATA interface just like hard drive and M.2 SSD plug into the M.2 slot on the motherboard. Now the good thing about SSDs is that they are more resistant to physical damage compared to hard drives. For example, if you physically damage a hard drive by dropping it, it could crash the disk and you will lose all the data. Ok, now modern computers may come with both SSD and hard drive. Faster SSD can have a lower capacity drive that could contain most important data such as documents, operating system, and software. And the slower hard drive can have a higher capacity drive that can store less important data such as videos. You can also build a computer with one large SSD for all of your storage. But that would increase the cost of a computer. So in order to save money, you can use both SSD and hard drive. However, there is also a way to overcome this issue and this can be done by using one physical drive instead of using two separate drives. This is known as SSHD or solid state hybrid drives. 
These drives combine the use of hard disk and flash memory. Hybrid drives take the benefit of large capacity and the low cost of magnetic disks with the speed of SSD. In a hybrid drive, magnetic disk used to store data and the flash memory used for caching of data. These drives are automatic. Firmware in the drive learn by itself as where to store data. Most frequently accessed data will be stored on flash memory, while less frequently accessed data will be stored on disks. Alright, so this was all about today's video. Thanks for watching this video on the comparison between solid state drive, hard drive and hybrid drive. If you like the video, please like it, share it and subscribe.